So we are back here on Circus Tower Defense. And guys, this video is going to be a ultimate tutorial guide on really, I wouldn't say how to get good. It's just how to overall get good um, unit and possibly, I guess, get good. Because um, Tower Defense games, they're not really... Um, not really games to get good on. Like, Tower Defense games are uh, they're luck-based games. Like, somebody can have, like easily 100 coins boom pop a mythic a first go all those games really about you know, tower defense games are just really about luck based but <clears throat> starting out so when you first play this game uh, this is for new or you know in-game players it, we're all gonna stand out we're all gonna stick uh, uh stick out with jester girl here that's what we get now the stats on it ain't the best you get 25 damage starting out she's 100 max and only one cooldown max 0 0.2 uh, 0 0.5 cooldown her range is 8 and you can put down 20 of her sounds good right okay now, some of you that already uh, use this code, some most of you might not get this chance, like for new players. So we're gonna use code Frosty. No, have my own code, guys. So know what that does? It gives you free coins. Now, about the luck thing, come over here, guys. Summon two units, like whatever units I get, I will use for this video to show you guys. Cause this is a, uh, okay. I got Dog Girl and I got, got Sad Mask Man. Okay. Now you can go the obvious route. I'm not saying spend like get the best units in the game. That's not what this is about right now, guys. All right, you see this? You see this golden jester girl? Now she's worth 29 robux. I, I tell you, 29 robux. It was a thousand. This is a good starting unit. If you guys can afford this, please do. I see. I already have it. I'm gonna show you why. Okay. So I just got dog girl. So she is 80 damage max. Uh, starting out 300 max. Three cooldown, but max out of one cooldown. You can use 20 of her. Now, sad mask man is the same thing, guys. He is about. Hold up. Uh, so he's a hundred starting out one cooldown. So he's probably out of your best out of your best bet So if you if he's gonna do that do like Dog girl since I did get her out of this video. Actually, let me see if I can get Well, I'm sure I use most of these uh from here including the golden so I'm, I'm gonna use I'll use Hmm, let me see what because some of you might get pink thing too. If you go down pink thing pink things 50 cooldown uh, 50 damage with three cooldown and eight so the thing is here, I'm I'm, I'm I'm gonna show you ways you guys can like still be able to like have sucky units, but still kind of still process in the game. Um, so let me use I want to use like a common and an uncommon, then legendary, then because I get I get five units. So she's an epic, so we're gonna use her as an epic. We're gonna fill the void there. So we're gonna use pink thing. We'll use a doll girl. Obviously, sad mask man now. There are some things called money units. Also, guys, you want to do, when you do when you do game, get games uh, play a game like this, go to your quest. Always go to your quest. The reason I say quests are important important because you do get a lot of coins during your weeklies, like 1,750. You can summon 10 units with that amount of coins. Uh, you can have to summon two with this. That you you'll, you'll get gems. Now, gems is for a later thing in this video. I'll tell you. If you guys go to shop, they have an exclusive shop. Do you have a Chef ball, you have a look like a little moon thing, and you have this guy. This guy is the bread and butter is what you need, guys. He is really, really good. He is, I won't say the best in the game, but he's really good to have. He's better than most things. He is what we call a summons unit. He summons like these things for you and does a lot of damage. I could use him, but mm, you know what? No, I think that'd be too easy if I was doing that hard. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna use him. But he's really good. He is one, he is what he is what you want to come to, guys. All right. So we have Mask Man. We're gonna put, we're gonna put down a our golden. Where's she at? Palm me girl. All right, golden jester girl. And we have one more slot. So we do got our uh, common, uncommon. Um, so we don't have a legendary right now. We're not gonna use a legendary for this video. Well, we could, but I'm not going to. Um, I, mean, I could. Who is the legendary up there? So angle dog. Okay, so here's what I want to do. We get rid of pink thing. I know, be all right. We're gonna put down angle dog. It will. And the mythical we're gonna use is the one that's up there right now, which is. We're gonna use Jax. We're gonna use Jax. Now guys, by all means, this ain't the best setup, but I'm gonna show you how to beat some maps with this setup here. I mean, I don't have a I don't have a money unit. Um, Use it to be money units like this angle dog won't be here. It'll be the sun 
So, actually, I'll do that. Alright. That, that will be our legendary. We're gonna use legend. We're, we'll, we'll assume sun's up there, guys. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna use the sun. Because he gives money. And his eight placements. So, like I said, guys. Base, base luck game here. You have to have great luck to get mythics in this game. Alright, so this will be a pretty good setup we have now, guys. We're gonna go towards... We'll, we'll go to the dark room. We'll go to the dark room. There is an event going on in this game right now, guys. But I'll, that'd be for a later time after I do this as well. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do this on... I want to do this on hard and show you guys a kind of a concept of how to beat like harder stuff with decent decent uh decent um units all right now this is gonna start so we're gonna put down a we're gonna put we're gonna put sad mask man first all right now let's look at my sad mask man guys 100 damage starting out the gate with a one cooldown ranges of eight so it's not bad right all right so what we're gonna do is we have a dog girl you know like 80, 80 damage with three cooldown. Yeah, we know she's not the best, but she's there when you need her. Now I'm putting these two up front because whatever these, whatever dog girls uh, don't get, Sad Mask Man will make up for it and help and help. Uh, also attack anything that like kind of like gets by. Like see these circles, because you'll eventually get stuff. Uh, her like starting at her max is at, her uh, starting is 80. So they're gonna be stuff that in, coming through this door. It's gonna be more than 80, and whatever these two don't get, these he will get. So I'll put one right there too. So now I have two sad uh, mass man there to get whatever she don't get. See, 90, boom. So he, she can only get so much. Also, we got the sun. Okay, the sun's happy go lucky. I'm gonna put my sons back here. Now, guys, what you wanna do is you want to. So these are uh, what we like to call farm units. They give you money. I think it's each way. Now. I always tell people you want to upgrade it as much as possible in this game. When I say upgrade, you like you want to upgrade as. Now, see what's going on here. How these things are getting by. I'm gonna put a golden Jester girl there just in case. The good thing about this game, you want to make sure you have things in the back just in case stuff like this gets by. Because they're not. I mean, they can only get so much. So can sad mask man and them. So what I'm gonna do is upgrade my first two mask men first. Just get con kind of things started because you see 200 damage now, 200 damage. The cooldown's a little bit different, and the range went a little bit up, you know? See, that's fine. They can get by. But in these situations, alright, so I almost have enough for Jack's, the, the Jack's plushie, right, guys? See how most of the stuff's kind of getting through? Oh, no, we're going to lose. Now, remember, there's uh, four placements you can have with uh, with uh, Golden Jester Girl. So, I'm going to put Golden Jester Girl right there. I'm going to put one. Now, see what happens. We got a Jack's plushie, right, guys? What you want to do is you want to put him near like kind of like the end because you know things are about to get happen so put him towards the end a little bit you know what i'm saying like you have four placements for her so make sure you spread out all of what you got i'm gonna put one right here in, in front of this corner so we have three we have one more we do have a placement yeah okay we, we have enough for one one more placement we are gonna put her by this corner right here now holly dogs is taking this long time like i said now, the good thing about why you want money farms, guys, is because you can upgrade as much as possible. Like, the, about this game, you want to upgrade it as much as possible. Now, this if this was upgraded a little bit more, it would have probably killed that holly dog, but it didn't. All right, so 300 damage, level 1. Not too bad, guys. Now, I think there is a kind of some... Now, there is a couple of visual bugs going on, guys, because you can't... She has more than one upgrade. I know that for a fact, but I'm not going to let that dis disturb this video. Now, you want to put as much as you can with these suns, guys, because the more suns... Uh, you have out the more upgrades you can do on your units i'm not sure the max upgrades you can have uh on the units i'm not sure how many you can have but you can have four of these uh golden gesture girls now we're gonna upgrade all of our units guys okay level two i know i know these have more than just one and two upgrades guys but for some reason it's i don't know now he might have i don't know he might have the right upgrades i'm not sure so good thing about these uh, um, higher end uh, placement uh, units, is, guys. They cost a little bit more, and they upgrade. Upgrade gets a little bit more, get crazy too. Now you want to do is you want to upgrade these you, your 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 son too to give you more money. See how much? See how, see the difference when I upgrade? How much more it's giving me now? I'm not sure. I'm not sure the uh, I'm not sure the pl exact placements for the son is, but we have five sons. Now see how as you see I have all these spread out. I could put more sad mass men down. Like I could put maybe one here like the object is you want to put stuff like 
spread out kind of guys it gives you that like all around placement so you know you're not gonna lose uh put one right here like i don't know if, uh, they might not make it this far because i think my jack plushies might destroy them but put them all spread out like especially in the back here like i'll put two uh i'll put two mad mess mad sad mess men here just in case you know they get by the door and you can always upgrade them too put them right there Oh yeah, now now we're looking now we're now we're looking pretty good. Even put a dog girl right here. Like this game's key, guys. You got the keys. The key is placement. If you have everything all spread out, like it, even on like with the even with the suckiest unit, you guys can win. Trust me. I'm not sure how many sad masked mans I can put down, but I'm assuming it's uh, 20 maybe. Because stuff will get harder, guys, as, as it goes by. Stuff's gonna have a lot more health. And when I say a lot more health, I mean a lot more health. See, see this moon right here has 20 something thousand health mm-hmm I was fortunate enough my Jack's plushie was able to destroy that all right now look at Jack's though those it's always good to have a mythic now if you don't have a mythic guys I'm not sure if you still can beat this now I, I could do it without a uh, mythic and show you but I'm I think there are legendaries that are actually pretty good that you don't need a, a mythic to beat hard mode it just said epic plus so if you long as you have a legendary you should be good right too not a farm le uh, legendary but I mean like an actual legendary now I don't, I don't know how many suns we can have but we're gonna put them down as much as we can until it says we can't anymore so I guess this is a lot we can put down we're gonna put down a we're putting down a lot all right, so eight is the max, guys, of suns that we can put down. I'm gonna upgrade all these suns as well. Look at the sun. Suns are very happy, you know, guys. It is. He is. He's just spreading. He's just spreading joy. He is not having a frown face at all. He is just here. Yeah. <clears throat> the more you upgrade these guys, the more you can upgrade all your units. Now you think it's getting pretty hard because the amount of the amount of enemies coming through are pretty rough. But like I said. That's why we have units all the way around the map that take care of this for us. Because they are not going to get through all these in uh, all my units. Now all the suns should be maxed out. That should be the last one. No, this might be the last one. Alright, all I'm, everything's maxed out guys. Now we should just focus on the units itself and max them out. Uh, max this doll girl out. Max this one out. Alright, see, not, not too bad at all. I'm gonna keep going and put some more dog girls on. I don't know how many dog girls I can have down. But we're gonna, up, we're gonna put some, we're gonna, we're gonna scatter some out here. Along the way here. Um, I'm gonna put one on this side as well. I'm gonna put one on this side. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put these down until I max all the dog girls out, guys. Don't know how many dog girls I can put. It might be 20, it might not. Same thing with mad, uh, the sad mask men. Put these down. Kind of like, kind of having want to have a whole. Now you're not gonna have, a, you might not have a farm unit, but guys, if you guys can still get majority of these down, you still will be pretty much centered, squared away. Now if I didn't have those two jacks right there, I don't think I would have been able to do that. But I, I might have. But we are gonna upgrade all of these. Now on wave 32, we're doing pretty good. Not too bad. Upgrade those two. Upgrade these two. Upgrade her. Upgrade him. See, it's not too, too bad. It's not hard. I mean, it will get hard. Trust me. But you guys, you guys see from the standpoint, guys, because you're not gonna get you're not gonna get the best units out of the gate. Now, if you do get like some of the great units, like stuff had like Jax Plus or Mannequin or like even the Clown. Kudos to you. It is hard to get some of those units, guys. Now, we are going to put a couple more Jack's, uh, Jack's plushies down, or the rabbit plushies. In case, in case some stuff gets... No, even if you have Mythics, this still can get kind of hard, guys. Oh, I guess you only put three down. Sorry. All right. Now, now, if they get by these rabbit plushies, it's up to my other units to actually defeat them. Because if they get by here, these are all maxed out. And, yeah. But we should be good. Everything, yeah, everything's maxed out. I'm going to start continuing to put down everything, guys. Now, guys, once you get a field like this... Mm-hmm. It is, uh... 
Now you might not, you might now get, you might not get all of stuff like this down. I've only got all this stuff down because I have a lot of money. So that's the only reason I might even put all this stuff down. If I didn't have the, uh, if I didn't have that money farm, I would not probably put it, be, be able to put all this stuff down and stuff. And th not only that is because the dog girls like were they not. Were they not called so good units? Like, they have a lot of placements you can put down. Like, I, th I believe that it could be 20. Okay, yeah, see? Dog Girl has, uh, Mr. Man has 20. I believe she has 20 as well. I think it's 20. I'm not sure. <laughs> That's a lot you can put down for Dog Girl. Wow. Maybe it's more than 20? Goodness. I mean, hey, guys, whatever makes you guys win... Like, like I said, whatever makes you guys win is what you want. I mean, I don't care if you put down 50. If those dog girls are doing, I don't know, a lot of each, I mean, you have to win. Now, I only I only did this in hard mode because, guys, they said you need an epic. And she is an epic. So, she should she, be pretty good. But, I wouldn't, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't tell you guys to do this if I know you got, these units couldn't be able to take on this kind of difficulty. Because Monster Queen is the last boss, guys, of health wise. Now this is just something I had to put a mix in I had to put a mix on all of the units in here because like I said, you might get lucky and you might get a mythic in here. Who knows, you know? Like I said, this games like these are just kinda they are kinda like RNG, guys. They they really are. So it hasn't took the Monster Queen's health health down yet, but it will. We might be able to do once you get to the jacks, it might be able to, because it yeah, see look at boom. It might not. It, it might. Oh, yeah. Boom. Munch Queen's down. Alright. Once these wrenches get towards the rabbit plushies, we'll, uh, where the wrenches will probably die. Because, yep, see? Mm-hmm. Now, look. These guys are doing These guys are doing so much as they can. But, yeah, thing. On hard, there's going to be a lot more health. 19,000 health. 19,000 health. But that's fine. That's fine. Now, if these guys would have make it, now if I didn't have these jacks plushy and they would have made it all the way to the end, they I think they would have been able to got them. All right, return. Uh, now that was hard. Nightmare would have been completely different. I would not been him did that with uh, with those units on nightmare mode, which would have been, yeah. Uh, now there is an event going on, guys, where it is. Um, what do you call it? It's called the Underworld event. You probably seen in my second to last video I think uh, so they have a battle pass going on now I'm not saying go ahead and speak and get on the uh, get, the, get the premium but the reason I say this guys is um, if you get this this battle pass rewards you with pretty good thing like there's a I wouldn't say it's a, it's a good starting out thing you see this derpy uh, you see this derpy jester girl I'm sure the stats real quick it's not bad it's a rare and it's it does it does decent not the best so look at 500 damage guys so that's probably been that would have been better than the uh that's obviously better than this one right here she's maxed at 1200 but the cooldown's pretty bad but i think it's better it's better than this one obviously I, I still think it's better than even this even though this one has a one cooldown that one's still better though yeah the reason i'm saying this is guys uh, especially for beginners that's what i love about events when they have events you can still kind of get free units now if you guys can go to back to the battle pass and grind it if you guys can go to level 25, there's a really good legendary you guys can get right here. Not just that, guys. You can farm this to actually summon to summon things like like rabbit plushie in in the summon unit. You know what I'm saying? That gives that that gives you more than enough coins to do to do a, a summon ten. See, watch, boom. See, I got a shiny mask rare. Close it, do it again. Uh, I got a shiny, then a shiny pink thing. Like I said, guys, you guys can get quite a bit of if you get, it gives you quite a bit of coins. Now, obviously, like me, I, I farm a lot, so I'm gonna have a lot more than that. But yeah, farm that, guys. You can get a lot of stuff. You get a lot of you can get a lot of units. Because the reason I say that is, go to the battle pass. Look how much coins you get from it. I mean, starting out, um, well, I'm not counting this because look, but 500, 500. That's 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 10 summons right there, guys. Like, cause you get you can summon nine with 900. Then you keep going up. Look, a thousand. There's another one. A thousand. Look at. That's, that's a lot of summons right there. So I hope you guys get... Yeah, but if you go level 25, guys, go to inventory. Okay, who am I looking for? All right, Doll Girl Plushie. 
150 damage. The, the cooldown, the cooldown 0.9. You can get five of her. She's a really good legendary starting out. She's not like OP like these other legendaries are. Like he has a one cooldown, but damage is 500. Or like him, or like her. She's like, well, I think this is better than that. She, I think she's better than any other legendary. The cooldown on her is 0.9. It's better than any of these right here. Yeah, none of them have a none, none of them have a better cooldown than her. But yeah, if you do that, you'd be good. Also, do remember do your quest, guys. If you guys do your quest, you get you get rewarded handsomely, handsomely too, because you guys can go to the shop and get the the crates. The crates are really good. Uh, if you guys go to the if you got, I mean the crates are not too bad. Uh, that's a shiny one, but look at 200 with a one cooldown. That's not that's not bad. You get 10 placements. Same thing if you go to um the, yeah moon. He moons a farm. Uh, I think he's better than the sun guys. If you guys see. Yeah, see, look at moons. Uh, the sun's max at 750. Moon's at 1500. Now, this is the host, guys. This is what you got. If you look at, he's a cooldown, but he's a summon. But look at, his damage is 50,000. I think it's more because I have the the uh, the upgrade wrath on it. But yeah, guys, do stuff like that, and you'll be really, really. You'll have a lot of units in this game that are easy to attain. Don't get any of the big units, guys. Just start out with Golden Jester Girl. Then after that, work your way up, save your money, save your coins, stuff like that, and trust me, you'll be you'll be really good in this game by uh, by by no means. Like seriously, I mean, I don't 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 have to don't be paid to win if you don't have to. Like these are just optional. Yeah, they they might look cool, but you can get good units, guys, and still be good. What I have to pay in robux, like this one. This is a robux. You can buy this with robux, but you can invite a hundred friends. If you don't hundred, you don't have a hundred friends. Hey, ask a random like yo help me out here i mean guys you don't have to be paid to win to be good in this game like you see you can just there and there's still free to play option like this you can get a free drone unit guys by completing the dark room it's a one percent but if you guys go to the unit the drone unit i have it's the same one 150 one uh she's a we one cooldown and you can place 20 of her that's not bad she's maxed at 2000 that's really good if you ask me so there's the, multiple ways you can get free you can get free guys okay you can do any of these. Now, I wouldn't recommend doing any of the uh, the endlesses unless you have at least a couple good mythics, maybe a couple good legendaries too as well, you know? Uh, but yeah, don't be paid to win, guys. Also, if you guys have gems, guys, another another non-pay to win feature, if you go towards this, it's a lot of gems, but that's 7,500. Let me go to ones you can actually get that are ain't too bad. Uh, Where's it at? Yeah, right here. Jester Girl... Yeah, she has 30 damage, but her cooldown's pretty good at 0 0.9. That's still better than some. And if you go to uh, Fancy Jest, Fancy Jester Girl, she's 90 damage, 0 0.45 cooldown. Not bad. You get that from the same thing too. Not even that. If you guys go towards your dailies, daily login right here. Look at day seven. There's, there's ways to get easy uh, units, guys. What I would have to pay to win. He's 150 damage, 1.2 cooldown. I mean, it's not bad. But yeah, like I said, it's not it's not bad as you think it is, guys. But I hope I have I hope this tutorial kind of helped you in some sorts of way. If it does have if it has helped you, please smash that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already, and guys. Turn on that notification bell. But I hope it has helped you guys a lot. Just do the strategies I've told you guys to do, and you can guys can beat hard modes and stuff like that all the time. But be safe, stay frosty, and I will catch you guys in the next one.